Hello and welcome back to the What's Up Fanes channel. I'm here with my daughter Allison today and we have a clean tutorial that takes place in our upstairs walkway because my two-year-old put some permanent marker on the wood canister. I have in the past done a previous tutorial like this where we try to get permanent marker out of the floor, out of the carpet. And I did kind of the same thing where we experimented. So wood's a little different than carpet. Obviously it's not fabric. And I don't want to damage any finish that's on the wood because we rent. I don't want to pay to fix anything. So um, we're gonna see small doses what works the best and doesn't damage the wood. Because I've never dealt with removing a permanent marker from wood, I thought it'd be fun to do some experiments because we always see those things about like, here's how to remove things and you never know if they really work. So we're gonna try, try them out, Allison's gonna help me. And so we, here's our lineup for today's cleaning materials. We have some toothpaste, a ratty Mr. Clean eraser. We have some rubbing alcohol, hand sanitizer, and we have some hairspray. So first up, I'm gonna try the magic racer because it seems the easiest. Now this is ratty and she's probably gonna do one, but it's lovely. So I am worried a little bit that it will damage the wood, but we're gonna see how well it works or not. Looks like it's working. Mostly. There's still some in the grain of the wood, so it doesn't really work if you have extra wood. Okay, now I'm gonna try some toothpaste. I've never really had like clean with toothpaste, but I see it recommended all the time, and I'm not even really sure how you're supposed to use it. So I have a little cloth that's wet on the corner, so I'm gonna squeeze out some toothpaste, and I guess we're <laughs> putting it on there. Uh, does it look to be working so far? I don't know if you're supposed to like let it wait. Oh my gosh, it's so gross. Um, I mean, I guess a little bit's coming off. Right? I mean, it's turning a little green. Alright, it's slowly coming off. Just rubbing with my finger here. See if it works better with a little cloth. Okay, so the toothpaste worked. It took a while on a lot of scrubbing, and there's still kind of still some residue kind of on those grooves and grain of the wood. So not my favorite method. Okay, so next I'm gonna try some rubbing alcohol and I'm gonna try to get it off this piece of wood. Um, I'm just gonna use a cotton ball and my 91% isopropyl alcohol and see if it'll do anything. So let's hope. Ooh, yeah. Oh yeah, definitely. Nice. Easy too. You can see it's really working. So I'm having the same issue again though, where it does a great job, but it still has some residue on the grain and the raised part of the wood but it's doing a great job and it's pretty quick. Um, just step up by one that does amazing, 100%. I'm gonna try to do this spot now and I'm gonna use some hairspray. So I'm just gonna spray it all up on there and then try to scrub it off with just a cloth and see what happens, okay? Go. And it's coming off pretty well. Well, kind of coming off, okay. Uh, I'm gonna try to spray it again and see if it gets more off. <coughs> Don't sit too close. And then I'm going to maybe do it while it's wet still. Mm. No, kind of the same. So it kind of works. All right, this is our last product, and we'll see how it works. So we're gonna be using the hand sanitizer. Um, I think I'm just going to squeeze it onto a cloth, 
and then apply it to the wedding. Oh, there we go. Ooh, what the hell? Looky here, save the best for last maybe, huh? <laughs> nice. Okay, you can see it. Woohoo! Cool. Yeah, I think I like that one. All right, so we finished trying out all five different things, and in my opinion, there's one clear winner. What do you think? Hand sanitizer. Hand sanitizer. It works better than all the other ones and got rid of a lot of the stuff in the grain, too, which is the problem with, I feel like, every other method. Every other method worked. Some took a lot more scrubbing, like the toothpaste, which I don't recommend because it's gross and messy. Um, but yeah, I'm totally gonna just go to town now with a bunch of hand sanitizer and some kids, and we're gonna get this thing done.